Hello, wonderful people. Good evening, everyone. This is Gallant Mama. <laughs> I'm sorry, work and all that. I don't have much time coming on live to come and drop some videos. But here I'm here today to give you a very wonderful tips that's going to help you. Okay. Anyway, if this is your first by, uh, first time stopping by to watch my video, feel free to press the red button so that you get notified whenever I post new videos. To my return subscribers, Galama, I'm saying thank you to you all. I appreciate you guys. I love you guys. Today, I'm going to be dropping a simple remedy that will going to make it to, that will attract wealth to you. That's going to attract wealth and favor for those of you always crying. I have an uncle in Lagos. He don't used to support me. Look. You have to hustle because you don't know you don't know what they went through to make this money. You need to struggle on your own. All you need is favor. If you really want to get help from anywhere, then you can do this. Stop pesting people to give you money. Look for something to do. Even if there is no job, you can start up a business of your own. I don't want to be seeing that in my inbox again. I have somebody in US, I have somebody in London, I have somebody here. Come on, you can't just them or force them to bring out their money. Anybody that wants to give you, will give you. But when you do some favor works on yourself, definitely the doors are bound to open. It might be that their, their eyes are closed for them not to help you. It might be you have negative energy in you for things not to work for you. It might be that they are, you are being, they throw spell on you, cast spell on you. Making things to be difficult for you. It might still be your under course, under foundational problems, different kind of problems and all that. You don't know. It might still be bad energy that is holding you. So if you're in this category, you have to do this. Because this is going to attract good wealth to you. Good wealth and favor. It's going to open door. Extraordinary door for you. Extraordinary favor. It's going to open it for you. So if you're watching me live, just listening to the items I'm going to mention right now. But first and foremost, before you do this, you have to cleanse yourself for three nights. With the spiritual bath I posted of the divine grace perfume, scent leaf, bitter leaf, ashes, sand, salt. You're going to take that bath for three nights. You watch the video. You check down in other videos that I've posted. You're going to see it there. Okay? You're going to take that bath. In case if there is any evil energy, whatever thing that is following you, that does not want to leave you for good things to come to you. You have to take the bath so that you wash them away. So, now, this is the remedy of what you're going to do, okay? These are the things you need to get. You need to get say, uh, seven cubes of su um, sugar. You need to get orange. All you need is the peel, the orange peel. Then you need um, um, cinnamon. Then you need um, nutmeg. Nutmeg. You need money. If you have coin, you can put coin. If you don't have coin, just put any Nara note. You think any higher currency you think can bring you luck. You have to do that. So what are you going to do? Then you get a white basin. Let it be stainless. A bit bigger. That the water can take you for some days. Okay? So after taking the spiritual baths, the one I posted, then you're going to do this. I bet you, money will flow. Favor with flow. Anything you desire with flow. I don't just come here to say what I don't know because I do them. And I use it to work on people and they work perfectly for them with a lot of testimony. So when you're going to do this, you're going to see the, the blessings of God upon your life. People, you will, never, you will no longer be denied access to anything you want. Favor will be your name. Wealth will be your name. Good things will be your name. Anything you desire, name them. It will come to you. So when you get a white basin, what you do, you're going to, don't please don't get rubber plate, oh, it will not work for this, okay? You need a, a basin like a stainless, whether it's stainless or iron stuff of a thing, let it be white. Whether white basin or white bucket is okay, but let it be stainless or iron. That is what you need for this ritual, so ritual bath. So you're going to peel the orange back. After the orange peel, you have to peel it. Then take the peel. Make sure there is enough water in that um, in that basin that will last you up to seven days. It's not much you're going to use all to take your bath. Okay? It's not once you're going to take your bath with it. So what you're going to do, the orange peels you got, you can get like five, six, or seven oranges. You peel them and put it inside the water. So when you are done putting it inside, inside water, make sure your cinnamon and... Um, 
and um, what am I doing with this name of the nutmeg is blended. Add nutmeg in it. Nutmeg attract wealth with cinnamon. They bring abundance favor to you. Add it to you to eat little little quantity. Just say as you are adding this and as you are putting this, that let I and you want to use to take your bath. Let it bring that which you never expected in your life. Every good thing, let it attract it to you. You add little, little of it inside. Then the seven cube of sugar, you're going to throw it inside. Then you put your money. Your Naira notes, if you have coin, you add your coin. If you don't have coin, there is nothing bad in it. You can use just Naira notes, okay? You're going to leave it for three days. After the three days, on the fourth day, now this bath is seven days bath. On the fourth day, please don't allow anybody to put hand in it. It's your own. Okay? It's for you alone. You don't have to share it with anybody. On the fourth day, what you do, make sure you take your normal bath. After taking your normal bath, you're going to take some water from there and say some prayers. Why bathing? From inside, oh, just put your hand from inside that bucket. Make sure you use your hand to stir it. Stir it very well. Stir it very well. After stirring it, you say a prayer of what you want. Say a prayer of favor. Say a prayer of wealth and riches to come to you. As about taking this bath. Take a little. I use it to pour from your head. Let it touch the down of your head. Let's make sure it touch all your body. Say everything you want. You wish yourself. I bet it's going to attract a lot of favor and luck for you. It's going to attract a lot of money for you. Say let money come to me. Those of you that always cry, I don't have one naira. I don't, if anytime I have money, I can't even see it. You do it. Take those baths. It's necessary for you, okay? You're going to take that bath. Then the next day, you're still going to repeat the same thing. After taking your normal bath, take from the water. Please don't clean your body. Don't clean your body. These seven days, don't clean your body. No cream for you. Don't wear slippers, so why taking the bath in your bedroom? Don't wear slippers. Just barefooted, that is what. Just barefoot, nothing on your leg. Stack naked. After taking your normal bath, you can do that. Use it to be applying on your, pouring on your body for seven days. For seven days. Now, after the seven days, the water is finished. Make sure you finish the water. Then what you do, you bring out the onion peel, uh, the orange peel. Get the orange peel, dry it in the sun. You're going to blend it. You're going to blend it. I will tell you what you do with it. Blend it, get a good oil, add some pitch of it inside, and put a sea salt, add it to it. Add a little uh, quantity of that cinnamon and, um, um, and nutmeg in it. Shake it very well. And use your mouth to charge it. Say whatever thing you wish, good things that you want to come to you. Say it's inside of it. Say your prayers. And um, anytime you are going out in the morning, you use to apply all over your body, your face. Let it just be as a form of a cream. You can also use your cream to rub it while going out after the seven days bath. Okay? This is what we're going to do. So after doing this, I bet you're going to see a lot of testimony. You're going to see a lot of many success await you as you do that. Gallant Mama, love you guys. See you in my next video. Bye.